First Alert Weather with meteorologist John Hickey. Morning friends, 515 here. It is your Saturday morning. We're waking up to a lot of clouds and eventually a little light mix of rain and snow beginning to make its way into the picture. Let's take a peek at what you can expect here as you're joining us with that cup of cocoa here for a festive morning. Looking at generally cloudy conditions. Temperatures kind of ranging through the 30s here in the Champlain Valley. A little bit cooler for you in the Upper Valley with a cloudy sky. Temperature at Lebanon right now looking at 28 degrees. Through the day, temperatures really not going to go anywhere thanks to the thick cloud cover that we have. Some light mix making its way in here by about 8 o'clock, lingering through noon. Later this afternoon, though, generally just kind of cloudy. So if you're heading off to the relative's house for a Hanukkah or a Christmas Eve celebration, things should be considerably more quiet by then. Although even during the day here, as we have a little light mix that shouldn't create too many travel problems, sunset tonight happening at 418. We'll take you town by town to give you an idea of what to expect for temperatures. Mid 30s across the Adirondacks, which is almost where you are at this point. 34, the forecast high, Saranac Lake, about 36 in Malone. Same for Danamora, about 41 should do you down at E-Town today. Forecast high in Burlington is up to 39 degrees. 36 in Barry, same at uh, Danville. 38 as well over in St. Johnsbury with that light mix making its way in here over the next couple of hours. 36 should do it in Randolph and across far southern Vermont. Looking at high temperatures today around 40 degrees or thereabouts with that light mix just starting to make its way in now. Check it out. First alert storm tracker. It's really light stuff. In fact, a lot of what's even popping up here on radar might not even be reaching the ground at this point, maybe across the higher terrain, but no raindrops or snowflakes here just yet in the immediate Champlain Valley. Really not a big system either. You can see it across the eastern Great Lakes moving east. It'll be here for a few hours and then out of here by the time we Look ahead towards your evening. Here's future cast. There are some of the raindrops and snowflakes just starting to make their way through by lunchtime today. Maybe you've got some last minute holiday shopping to do. I think that would be your best bet for finding any kind of raindrops or snowflakes. But look what happens as we take you into the evening. Things kind of quieting down, just a cloud filled sky. Santa shouldn't have any problem delivering the toys tonight. Uh, no weather woes and there's even a little bit of snow for the reindeer to land on out there. That's good news. Now we'll really clear it out for tomorrow and it's going to be kind of one of those backwards days where temperatures are warmest in the morning and actually cool through the day and then tomorrow night very cold and that sets the stage for a kind of an active day as we look to Monday. It'll be windy. Temperatures are going to rise some 40 or more degrees by the afternoon. We'll also be looking at a rain and even icing threat too. We'll keep that in mind. Here's uh, the future cast snow map. Not much snow expected again. Generally just a slushy inch for some of the higher terrain to kind of recap and reset what to expect. Generally just kind of cloudy here today by the Christmas Eve time 36 degrees for tonight 30 as you're waking up tomorrow morning, but by the time you're having dinner, temperatures cooling into the mid 20s on the five day plus two. This is what I'm talking about for an active Monday. Look, we get down into the single digits by the afternoon. It's low 40s areas east of the Green Mountains have the best bet for any kind of icing threat, but it will be windy everywhere. Gusts over 40 miles per hour, pretty likely. And then the active weather continues with another system tracking our way as we look ahead towards Thursday and Friday.